You too. What's going on? Welcome back to What Could Have Changed. My name is Trey. I've been saying that the last couple of videos, but yeah. Okay, so gays against groomers. Okay, once again, we have our disagree disagreements, but what I don't agree with, um, we both cannot agree with, is the things that they do to children. And some of these people are really going after the gays against groomers. This place, when they first started as a company, man, they've been hated almost ever since the first day of inception. And I can't hate on it. At the end of the day, if we're both trying to protect kids, we can unite on at least this subject. Let's get right into it. So, to give you some background on this, this guy was at the Gays Against Groomers. He came over to the tent and he just went off the hinges. Let's get it. No, you're telling trans kids that they don't deserve to be alive in the right body. We never said that. We never said that. Then why are you trying to keep them away from health care? Sorry, that first part is probably kind of hard to hear. He's saying that he said uh, pretty much what he said was you don't want trans kids to be alive. So just keep that in mind and then you'll hear what he said. No, you're telling trans kids that they don't deserve to be alive in the right body. We never said that. We never said that. Then why are you trying to keep them away from health care? Because it's irreversible. You need to be 18. Who cares? You can't join the military. Why, why, do you want, why do you want children to be fertile? That is fucking disgusting. Fertile children. You've got to be That they're healthy. Pedophile. Pedophile. Fertile children. Fertile children. What is wrong with you? Who the fuck cares what a child's body looks like? Okay, go Yes, step over there. Don't these people always seem to go right off the hinges? Like, listen to this reaction. This, this they didn't even get, what, 30 seconds in? This isn't even a 30 second video, so we're talking 10 seconds into the conversation. This is how it goes. Fucking disgusting. Fertile children. You got to be they're healthy. Pedophile. Immediately start screaming that to them. He said, we're disgusting because we don't want kids to be, we want kids to be fertile. This, there's more to this, but this guy is upset that we want kids to be fertile. He calls us, <laughs> he calls us files, X-Files. You know what I'm saying? He wants to call us that because we want kids to be fertile. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. You don't find it more disgusting that you don't want kids to even have the option of having children when they get older. You find that more disgusting than us saying we want kids to be fertile. Are you, what is wrong with you? We're not wanting kids to be fertile. We're wanting them to wait until they have the knowledge to make a decision that they can't change. Once this happened, guys, if y'all ever seen the surgery that they do, I want y'all go look it up. If you have the, don't, make sure you're not eating. But guys, really go check out the surgeries that they do to these people. When you see the surgery that these guys are advocating for, it is absolutely insane when you watch it up close. It is baffling like you're like that's normal like what you see happening when they are splitting somebody wide open and removing their testicles and penis it is not a pretty sight it's not like oh it's just it's not like that guys it is an extreme surgery it's an extreme surgery and in the reverse too when they close it up and put you know they take off the arm graft or leg graft Oh man, and that's and you have to pray to God. There's no complications, because they already say it's a life-changing surgery. Why is it life-changing? Not just only because you are making it to where you cannot have children, but also it's every year you got to constantly go in for checkups for the rest of your life. How much money do you think that's gonna cost? You think a fifty thousand dollars surgery is gonna stay fifty grand? You got to go every, and if, if there's zero complications, you still got to go back and make sure everything's okay. Pay money, pay money, pay money, pay money, pay money. Day in, day out, day in, day out, day in, day out. And he's mad that we want to make kids fertile or at least give them the opportunity to wait to make the decision. This guy is an absolute goofball. Goofball. Okay, let me show y'all the second video. Cause y'all, you, you, these people, it's always crazy too, because they always come, oh yeah, here's a, 
These people always come unhinged. Unhinged. Let me show y'all the other part of it. <clears throat> oh, wow. Oh. So he picks up a broken security, bottle. Dude's got some glass over here. It starts following him. Uh, we have security right here. He's with us. Oh, I thought he was. I didn't know he was right there. Oh sure. No. Leave us alone. What are you gonna do with that? What the fuck are you gonna do with that? I'm gonna throw it in the trash. Then go now. throw it away. The fuck no. Throw it away. I'm marching with you. I just. These people become unhinged And I'm gonna stick with what I've said before man And we're gonna read about this In an another video eventually But every time I hear about people who are trans Or for this stuff You normally notice that they have other mental issues right They normally have other mental issues so it's not like these people are just perfectly normal except for the one thing they want and that's to be a guy or girl it's it's just that simple they're like my life is perfectly fine i just want to be a guy it's normally never how it works normally when somebody's going to that extreme links they normally have other mental issues going on and when you hear somebody like this going off the rails just because we just said oh, we just want to wait till kids are 18 what ah! this is like whoa is that you think that's a normal reaction i understand when there's righteous anger but that is insanity you willing to you willing to stab me with a bottle allegedly you want to stab me with one of these just because i said protect the kids i mean chill but we're the ones that are off our rockers and mentally insane. Right. <laughs> okay, but that's okay. The more we show videos like this, the more you keep exp just keep exposing yourself. Y'all just keep yelling and screaming and kicking and attacking us. You will be your own downfall. We are literally watching this cult eat themselves. <clears throat> it's like the Joker once said. These, ah, these. These civilized people, watch it. When the chips are down, these these civilized people, they'll eat each other. See, I'm not a monster. I'm just ahead of the curve. <laughs> anyway, let me know what you guys think about this, man. What do you think about this person going completely unhinged, protecting the children? Catch you on the next video. Peace.